So today we're going to get you guys on the new HP IMC Basic. So the first thing you're going to have to do is go to the website and download the code. Once you got that done, then you're going to unzip the files to your desktop and the next step is to install, which we will take you through now. Um, as you'll see, this is uh, pretty easy. So let's take a look. Hey guys, so here we are on a Windows 2008 R2. Uh, one thing I do want you guys to notice is the time here. I've got it at 2.40 a.m. Uh, burning the midnight oil a little bit, but uh, through video magic, I'm going to speed up this installation, but I want you guys to notice how fast this actually is. So, again, I have uh, already pre-downloaded and unpacked the IMC basic installation file here. So we're going to take a quick little tour here. We've got the manuals directory, which has all the manuals that you could possibly need here. Uh, Readme files, administrator guides, um, all that good stuff is uh, supplied with the installation package. We've got some tools directories, so the DHCP plugins, which uh, you can read about what those are for in the administrator guide. Uh, and then we've got the install. So we're going to click on the install button. And that, of course, will start the install process. So IMC Basic, we've uh, we've done, I think, a very good job at making sure this is just a straight through process. So we click OK. That's the install file location, the data file location. That's the port number for HTTP and HTTPS that you want to access. You can change those to 80 or 443 or whatever that you want it to have access to. Um, we're going to click OK here after the components have all been checked. All the uh, system requirements have been checked and verified. And from this point on, um, we're basically going to just click the next button and watch it do its work. So the batch deploy, just to give you guys an idea of what this is actually doing, this is where we're going to actually deploy the IMC component. So IMC is a modular um, NMS, and, and we're going to deploy everything here. Um, it does require a database. So in this case, we have provided uh, SQL Server 2008 R2 Express, or MSDE, um, that is part of the installation package and fully supported with IMC Basic. So um, automatically, no intervention on you, the operator's part at all. SQL is going to go through its installation process. And we're going to wait for that to continue. So there we are, SQL is completed its installation and the rest of the install will now complete and in a mere 20 minutes you have installed a fully functional NMS. Um, that's it. In the next video we'll look at getting started with your new IMC basic. See you guys next time on the next IMC management tutorial.